My name is Dana Speed. I'm one of the owners of the music company DJ and event coordinators. Victoria joined by Dana Speed and Sierra Body Works right here up the Boulevard. I would like to welcome each and every one of you to our third annual Meet in the Street and Holiday Light Parade. I am joined this evening by my faithful sidekick, C.B. Morgan from Dolphin Graphics. In just a few moments, we will begin the Parade of Light. This evening's Meet and Street event is presented by Alameda County Community Development Agency, the music company, Castor Valley Eden Area Chamber of Commerce. Tonight's festivities are also sponsored by the Alameda County Public Works Agency, the Castor Valley Forum, Castor Valley Rotary Club, Robert Souza of Castor Valley TV and Castor Valley News Magazine. These organizations and those participating today urge you to shop locally this holiday season. We would also like to take this moment to thank the many people who made this night a great success. Eileen Dalton, Jamie Ofanos, and Carla Badosta, Alameda County Community Development Agency. Jordan Figueroa, Castro Valley Sanitary District. Alameda County Public Works. Lieutenant Junior Gray, Paul Norton of the USS Hornet and the Sea Cadets. Let's hear it for the Sea Cadets, everybody. <laughs> Heidi Hassar, Rotary Club of Castro Valley. Bill Mulgrew and Ashley Strasburg, Castro Valley Eden Area, Chamber of Commerce. We have at least 35 entries from all over the community participating in this event tonight. We have floats, classic cars, music, dance, and of course, we have lights. All right, we are ready to light up the boulevard as we begin the 2014 Castro Valley Parade of Lights. Let's do this thing. Hello? We have... First up, we have Alameda County Sheriff's Office and CHP. All right, everybody, let's go. Tonight, bringing in our light parade is the Alameda County Sheriff's Department and California Highway Patrol. Special thanks to the Alameda County Sheriff's Department and CHP for all the support in this evening's events and for keeping our community and roads safe. We would like to thank all the men and women who work every day to ensure our safety. Let's hear it for the Sheriff's Department, everybody. Okay, we have two color guards tonight before we do the national anthem. First of all, we have the VFW, Veterans of Foreign Wars Color Guard Post. Let's hear it for them, everyone. We also have the USS Hornet Sea Cadet Color Guard. The Grey Ghost Division and Training Ship Kearsarge Drill on board the USS Hornet in Alameda. The cadets are ages 10 to 18 and have opportunities to train all over the nation. To sing our national anthem, we have Brianna Knapp. Brianna has been singing since the age of five and music has been her passion ever since. Through Bedford Studios, she performs regularly at the Alameda County Fair and other community events such as the Castro Valley Street Fair and Hayward Zucchini Festival. Brianna also plays guitar, flute, and piano, but she loves singing the best. Go ahead, Brianna. Hello? Okay. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's So proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright. 
bright stars through the perilous fight. O'er the ramparts we watched, o'er so gallantly streamed. Brianna Knapp, everybody. Thank you. Very nice. All right. Next up, we have Castro Valley Pride. Castro Valley Pride is here to shine their awesome rainbow lights and remind Castro Valley's gay families that they are fine just the way they are. Their fifth annual Pride event is Saturday, July 11th on Redwood Road. Mark your calendars now. Next up, we have the Elliott family. Southern Pacific Daylight Train. Here comes the Elliott family and their Southern Pacific Daylight Train. Leading the way is Dad, the railroad crossing sign. Four-year-old Jonathan is a family girl engineer and Mom is following behind as the coal car. Chugga chugga choo choo. Next up, we have Vanoy Elementary School. Vanoy Elementary School right here in Castor Valley. Their message for you is let your Vanoy pride shine. Okay, next up we have CV Sand. This is the Castro Valley Sanitary District. Holidays from the Castor Valley Sanitary District. Thank you to all the 4R star businesses in Castor Valley and everyone's continued effort as we work towards zero waste future. If you have any questions on becoming a 4R star business, recycling or composting, please visit our website or give us a call. Castor Valley Sanitary District. Next up we have the Great Dickens Christmas Fair. 
Enter the world of Charles Dickens and revel in a Victorian London where it's always Christmas Eve. The streets resound with the celebrations of the season. Lively calls of street vendors ring out above the crowd and mingle with holiday carolers. Tempting aromas of roasted chestnuts and hearty foods fill the air, enticing shops overflow with one-of-a-kind Christmas gifts. They recreate old London town, transforming over three acres of vintage exhibition halls into lamplit lanes. If you haven't been out to the Dickens Christmas Fair, ladies and gentlemen, you need to make your way out. You know, on a personal note, people ask me if I ever get tired of spending every weekend in my holiday season running my booth at Dickens. And the truth is, the Dickens Fair is everything fun about Christmas. Bring your family to London this year, people. Weekends, November 22nd to December 21st. Next up, we have Castro Valley Elementary School. In the heart of Castor Valley is Castor Valley Elementary School. We are a spirited school community. Castor Valley Elementary is proud to feature its majorettes and drum major. Our squad is instructed by Mrs. Beverly Stone. They practice hard to prepare this routine and cheer for you tonight. Give it up for Castor Valley Elementary School, everybody. Okay, next up we have one of our judges winners. This is Tony Lloyd and his 1951 Ford Woody. Longtime Castor Valley residents, Tony and Kathy Lloyd and their granddaughter Sophia Lamondo are cruising in their 1951 Ford Woody. Olaf the snowman's overweight brother Frosty has waxed up his surfboard and is waiting for the perfect wave. They are the winner of the Spirit Award, Christmas Spirit Award. Number 13, we have Eden Bicycles. Eden Bicycles has partnered up with Bike Walk CV this year. Eden Bicycles is located right here in the Castro Village Shopping Center and offers bikes for all ages. 15% off all kids' bikes this holiday season. Bike Walk CV is a locally formed group of concerned CV residents working towards a better bike, pedestrian, and active transportation for Castro Valley. Visit Bike Walk CV Facebook page to find out how you can get involved. Next up, we have Canyon Middle School. They are the winners of the School Spirit Award. Congratulations, Canyon. Canyon Condors light up the world. Members of Canyon Middle School's leadership class and student council are representing the global diversity of our school. Innovators of the future, our students soar to great heights and light up the world around them. Go Canyon! Okay, next up we have the Perry family and they have Sully in the back of their car. Sully is 
the Grand Marshal of our parade. All right, ladies and gentlemen, next up we have Michelle's Dance Explosion. Michelle's Dance Explosion is actually a winner tonight. They won in the Harmony category for the 2014 Castor Valley Light Parade. Congratulations, MDX. Celebrating their 10th year in Castor Valley, MDX is very excited to be part of the Light Parade this year. Run by Michelle Barrios and Sean Harrington, MDX is family-oriented studio where realizing the natural talent of your child is their passion. This is MDX, everybody. Turn it up! Let's hear it for MDX, Michelle's Dance Explosion, right here in Castro Valley, everybody. Congratulations, ladies. Next up, we have Redwood Christian Schools Deck in the Halls. Please welcome the Little Red Schoolhouse from Redwood Christian Schools, lighting the way to wish everyone a blessed Christmas season as they celebrate the birth of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Their float and van is 40 foot in length and has more than 3,100 lights. The entry is driven by Steve Gillette and Mike Cady, riding shotgun and running tech. The students walking behind the entry wished everyone a Merry Christmas and thank all of our military veterans and first responders for their service to our great country. Redwood Christian Schools serves students both locally and internationally in grades K through 12. Redwood Christian School has open enrollment for students to join their community throughout the year. Tuition grants are available for qualified families. Let's hear it for Redwood Christian Schools, everybody! Next up we have Kurt Burton Photography in business since 1980. Portrait and School Photography. If, if you ever need any type of photography here in Castro Valley, Kurt Burton is the guy to go to. We see him at just about every wedding and event and special thing that we do. Kurt's wonderful. It's here for Kurt Burton, everybody. Next up, we have Steve Ontiveros and family. We welcome Steve and Julie Ontiveros as they ride on their 2002 Harley Davidson Road Glide. Steve's a member of Rotary Club of Castor Valley. Julie owns Good Times Daycare, a small family in-home daycare. Let's hear it for the Ontiveros family. Next up, we have Castor Valley Matters. Here comes Castor Valley Matters Pirate Ship. Castor Valley Matters is a group of concerned citizens united in a goal to make Castor Valley better. 
We are advocates, we are community leaders, and we want to help you understand how Castro Valley works. Check us out on Facebook and at castrovalleymatters.org. All right, next up we have the Grand Marshal Award going out to this next float. This is Santa's Workshop, Supervisor Nate Miley. Alameda County Supervisor Nate Miley, AKA Papa Elf, is delighted to be part of this year's parade. He and his elves wish everyone safe, a safe and happy holiday season. Congratulations on your Grand Marshal Award for the Castro Valley Life Parade. Women, men, and children present Dream a Little Dream of Me. Located right here in downtown Castro Valley, Ray Talbot Salon truly appreciates all of your business. Next up we have the Castor Valley School of Music. Let's hear it for Castor Valley School of Music everybody. Read is wrapping up its fourth year at Castro Valley Library. It's a monthly program that provides the opportunity for elementary school children to read aloud to a dog and improve their skills and confidence. Dogs make great non-judgmental listening partners. Sign-ups are available in the children's section at the library. I want to do that. I want to go read to a dog. That would be fun. How cute is this, everybody? Oh my goodness. All right, next up we have Reach Ashland Youth Center. Open since 2013 and provides youth development services. Open to all from 11:24 free, Monday through Friday, 12 to 8.
Give it up for Reach Ashland Youth Center. Next up, we have Newton's Ice Creamery. Newton's Ice Creamery Banana Split Float. Here comes a gigantic banana split representing the ice creamery. Riding in the float is Shay Newton, part owner and general manager of Newton's Ice Creamery, accompanied by Kyle and Kayla, great-grandkids of Dave and Kathy. This year, they are celebrating 10 years on the boulevard. It's a great family restaurant featuring homemade ice cream, chocolates, delicious burgers, sandwiches, salads, and homemade soup for your enjoyment. Santa's gonna be at the ice creamery directly after the parade. That's where the after party is, so make sure you make your way down to the ice creamery afterward. Miss Livermore Junior Rodeo Queen 2014 Michelle Hewitt and Miss Rao Ranch Junior Rodeo Queen 2014 Cicely Brooks. Also Rao Ranch Rodeo Queen Gianna Armanino. Next up, we have Raoul Sadlery. Raoul Sadlery is your local stock for all things Western and custom. We have great stocking stuffers and cozy slippers. While you're in the shop, make sure you check out the custom designs from In Your Bucking Dreams, handmade at Raoul Sadlery. Made in the USA. Happy holidays, everyone. The Tap Dancing Christmas Trees! The Tap Dancing Christmas Trees under the direction of Pam Drake join us from Dance Tap Performing Arts Center in Alameda. Over the past 24 years, the Tap Dancing Christmas Trees have performed as the opening act for America's Children's Holiday Parade, the Niles Parade, the Napa Valley Parade, and the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade in 2001, 2004, 2007, and 2012 in New York City. They've been in the Hollywood Christmas Parade twice, and this is their first appearance in Castor Valley. Mr. Claus and Mrs. Claus right there next to him. Don't miss the after party. The red carpet event immediately following the third annual Castor Valley Light Parade. Meet and greet Mr. and Mrs. Claus on the longest red carpet in Castor Valley at Newton's Ice Creamery. Special guest appearances by surprise cast members and parade entries are expected. There will be photo op and selfie ops with attending parade stars. Professional paparazzi supplied by Kurt Burton Photography. No RSVP is required. Come on down to the ice creamery. That is the place to be right now for the after party. Thank you so much for coming out, everyone. On behalf of Music Company, we want to thank everybody that came out tonight. We had a blast. We hope everybody else did too. Thank you so much. Good night, everyone.